Hello, my name is Amanda Henry and I'm a technician at Pluggable Technologies. Bluetooth Low Energy has a huge potential for applications, including home automation, but we need a way to connect all the cool home gizmos to the cloud to enable remote connections for viewing and control. Right now, your smartphone makes a great gateway, but what you really want is something that connects to your devices when you're not home. That is a fixed gateway. This video demonstrates one way to construct a very powerful gateway using the pluggable Bluetooth adapter, also known as the USB BT4LE. We won't cover any Bluetooth detail today. For more information on that, see the posting from a few weeks ago, referenced in the text of the posting. We also won't be covering the gateway concept or software, but you'll find information on that using the links we provided to this package at the Bluetooth SIG. The Bluetooth SIG just released a Bluetooth Low Energy Gateway example project using the Raspberry Pi, and it works very well with the small pluggable USB BT4LE and Wi-Fi adapters. The sample gateway project contains two servers, a front-end web server, which responds to the user requests and routes those requests to the corresponding handlers at the gateway server, and then the gateway server, which then itself interacts with the target devices in the range using our Bluetooth dongle and handles all the low energy read and write requests. Again, the complete project with documentation and files are available from the SIG. See the text of this post for appropriate links. For this setup, you'll need a standard Raspberry Pi, in this case a Pi 2 Model B, a pluggable USB BT4LE, a pluggable Wi-Fi adapter for a total wireless connection, an internet connection through Wi-Fi or LAN, and the TI sensor tag with enabled accelerometer. Now we need to start up the gateway. First, you'll need to start a terminal, then navigate to the directory. Once you're there, enter sudo node. Next, we'll need to start up the node server. This server could be anywhere, including the cloud, since it just makes requests to the gateway, but it makes the most sense on the Pi. Start a terminal. Navigate to the directory and enter node period. Once you've done that, open an internet browser window and enter this address. Then scan. Once the scan is complete, look for the TI sensor tag. We'll find it in the node list. Navigate to IOAA640, then write a 1 to AA66. And you'll notice that the LEDs and buzzer flash. We demonstrated a Bluetooth low energy fixed gateway for home or office devices, all enabled with the pluggable Bluetooth USB BT4LE and our USB Wi-Fi adapter. For more information on this, check out the links below. As always, feel free to ask any questions in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe, and thanks for watching.